about the Philadelphia Mint Mark. The United States Mint was created in Philadelphia in 1792 to date. Philadelphia was the first U.S. Mint and has always been the main facility. It was the only mint producing coins for the entire nation until 1838. Most coins from the historic Philadelphia have no mint mark, with the exceptions of the wartime nickels of 1942 through 1945, the Anthony dollars 1979 through 1981, and the 2017 penny, which was made in recognition and celebration of its 225th anniversary and all Philadelphia coins after 1979. I'm going to show you some coins starting with the pennies where there is no uh, P mint mark and where the P mint mark starts and where it's located. And of course right here we have the Indian head which will not ever have a P mint mark showing on it. And then our next coin whoops, is going to be a weedy that's a 1939 and of course this will never have a P mint mark visible on it and this is the only penny that's going to have the P mark on it it's the 2017 and that's because it is in recognition and celebration of its 225th anniversary like I said it is the only US penny that will have the P mint mark on it and as you can see, we get into 2018. Here's a Philadelphia 2018 penny and no mint mark. It is gone. So save your 2017 peas. And here we got the nickels and we start with a buffalo. Of course, the buffalo will not have any mint mark, any P mint mark. But with an exception of the wartime nickel from 19. 42 through 1945, the war nickel does show the P mark above the Monticello. As you can see, big P mark also. And then now we go like to a 1959 nickel and you will not see a P mark. Not until like 1980. And here's a more modern nickel, the 2017, and you can clearly see the P mint mark. Now we go to the standing quarter, standing liberty quarter. We got a 1930 and no, you will never see the P Philadelphia mint mark on these older quarters. And still in 1954, you will never see a P mint mark on the 1954 quarter. And here now a way more modern. 1995 you can clearly see the P mint mark by his ponytail but I believe they started showing up in 1980 the P marks on the quarters here's an even more modern quarter I believe this is a 2012 without flipping it over but you can see the P mark is still by the ponytail and then we go so I'm sorry about the sniffles I have a cold here we go to the 19, uh, we're at the half dollars now, 1941 Walker. And yes, you will never see the Philadelphia P mint mark anywhere on the Walker half dollars. Uh, you won't see the P Philadelphia mint mark on any of the 60s, uh, the silver coins, the silver half dollars. This is a 67. So it is 40% silver, but yes, you will never see the Philadelphia P mint mark on them. But then when we get to a 2007, you can clearly see the P mint mark right above the, the year. This is a NIFC half dollar. They are not intended for circulation, but you can clearly see where the P mint mark is located on that half dollar. And then we go to the dollars. And the Morgan dollars, you will never see a P Philadelphia mint mark on the Morgan dollar. You will never see a P mint mark on any of the peace dollars either. They were not put on them. The first year the P mint mark 
was put on a dollar coin is the Susan B. Anthony in 1979. And you can clearly see the P. It's on her left uh, shoulder collar, just off to the left of the left. <laughs> and um, then we go on to the Sacagawea. Here we have a tw 2000. You can clearly see the P is on the bottom. And then we go to the presidential dollar. And this is the last year the U.S. had made the dollar coin. So I don't know if this is the end of the dollar coin forever, but this is the last dollar coin that was made for circulation, which, which means, you know, you can go to the bank and ask for them. Um, that's how I got most of mine. That's how I got all my years and dates and presidents and um, they sell them in rolls and everything. So if you want to collect them all, just ask for a roll at the bank. But the P mark is on them, but it's in a weird place. And I hope you can see this. It's on the edge. There we go. I'm trying to show you. I hope it shows up on the camera. I think it is. Well, I see the P for sure. But it, that is where the year and some more information and the mint mark. But you can uh, clearly see the P Philadelphia mint mark on the U.S. dollar. Our last dollar made, our last U.S. dollar coin made for circulate, circulate, <laughs> circulation. <laughs> okay, so I just wanted to kind of show you where the P mint marks are and uh, where they are not located. Uh, the P mint mark is kind of known as the no mint mark. All right. I want to thank you all for watching my video on the United States Philadelphia mint mark. Hope you enjoyed. Have a great day. Bye now.